trying to get my head on straight. You're even farther than yesterday. I don't want to fake this, but I can't. How did it go, girl? It went well, but I got scared, Selena. He wanted to call the police officers. Really? How did you not get out? I took Angel and left, but trust me, I made sure I stuck on my story. And then I spent the remaining time with Annabelle. With Annabelle? She called to see you? As soon as I left the house, she stopped and picked me in her car to a nearby restaurant for us to chat. She asked a lot of questions and I gave her the right answers. What? This is moving real good. I didn't think this would happen so fast. I was surprised as well when she asked that we talk. I think she also has her doubts on Danny. You have sent her more pictures today. Oh, you know what? Ask to meet her privately again. I have a plan and I think this will work out. Selena, you might soon have to change your plans because they'll find out soon. What makes you think so? Don't tell me you are scared already. I told you you wanted to call the police. Selena, I am not interested in no police. Do you know how long I stayed in prison? I am not going back again. You are not going back. I promise you. And I told you we can make a lot of money. I know, but I want to spend my money outside of the prison, not in the prison. How about if I pay you some money right now, would you still be interested? I didn't say I'm not interested in this. I'm just scared of the police. They won't call the police, don't worry. Hello, you seem quite busy today. Baby, I'm sorry. I've not been able to call you since last night. I've been so busy. So busy to have my time. I see. Are we still going out for lunch? Baby, I'm busy. You can see it by yourself. And I have to finish up. Baby, you said we would go out for lunch together. Remember you weren't available yesterday. I know. And I'm truly sorry about that. I wanted to come over but I was unable to. Plus, I'm not still done. And you know I can't leave what I'm doing. Are you telling me it's a no? That we are not going out even today? I'm busy, baby. I sent you a message that we should cancel. Didn't you get it? I didn't get any message on my phone. We've not spoken since last night. And I told you that I'm actually very busy. Baby, I've been here since last night. Are you actually pissed at me or did something happen again? Baby, I'm not pissed at you. I told you I'm trying to sort out work. I promised to call you. You know what? I'm sorry, babe. I don't know what to say to you right now. I'm sorry. Kennedy, she just left my office now. I will send you the address of where she's going for lunch. I'm sending you the address, man. Thanks a lot. I really can't do this. Why does he keep ruining everything for me? Who was that? Amos? Yes, and he wants me to meet up with Caitlin for lunch today. And you are going to do that? No, I'm not. I told you we are spending the whole day together. Just me and you. You had better not, because I won't let you do that. I've been thinking of how we'll celebrate your birthday next month. We are not having a celebration. We agreed on that already. That was your decision, not mine. I didn't agree, baby. We are having a party. You're not having a party. Baby, you won't believe that we are actually going to have lunch in the same venue as Kate. Really? That's nice. I'll get to see what she looks like. There she is. She's actually very beautiful. Amos is very lucky to have her. I know, right? I keep telling him that, but he doesn't listen. So I guess you're going to sit over there with her soon. I don't want to. I'm going to stay here with you. Today is for us, babe. I know you want to go over there, so just go. I'll be here waiting. Come on, baby. No, I'm not going there. I'm here with you. Just go on and join her over there. It's fine with me. It's just lunch, baby. Baby, are you sure about this? Yeah, I am. Baby, I am sorry for what happened this morning, but I'm telling you, I don't know that lady who claims to be Selena. Danny, I want you to come out clean, but you keep avoiding the truth. Just admit it that you didn't tell me about her, and I know you will have your reasons. I don't have any reason to lie to you, Annabelle. That lady is a liar, and I don't know why she's doing this, but Angel isn't my daughter. Are you really going to keep saying this? Because I spoke to Selena today and she told me that that's your daughter. You both got married. I don't know that lady. What is going to make you believe me? The truth. I'm just pained that you didn't tell me and you're still lying to me. I am not lying, but you're refusing to believe me. You want to believe what she's saying. I don't want to believe her. I want to believe you. But Danny, you're not being honest. I know what I'll do. I'll get a DNA test done to prove it to you that she's not my daughter and she's damn aren't related to Selena or whoever that woman claims to be. You're really going to have a DNA done? Yes, I will. Because I know what I'm saying. Because I know that I'm saying the truth. Make sure to call Selena. 
tell her to be in the hospital with Angel. I'm tired of all this. I'm also tired of it. I hope you'll be happy when you find out that she's not mine. And maybe you learn to trust me again. It's a surprise to see you here, Caitlin. What? Kennedy, are you following me? Don't tell me you're a stalker. I was here way before you. I saw you when you walked in and I asked myself if you were actually following me around. No, I am not that kind of lady to follow a man around, but I feel you are the kind of person to do that. So, what are you doing here? What do you think, beautiful? I'm here for lunch. Do you? Because this is kind of one of my favorite spots and I haven't seen you here. I usually come here for lunch. Maybe because you haven't noticed me before, and I don't think I've seen you here before. So how can this be your favorite spot? You're also a regular here. I am. I can tell you the names of all the staffs that work here to prove to you that I'm a regular here. <laughs> I believe you already. You don't need to start mentioning names. Having lunch alone, or are you waiting for someone here? It's just me, and maybe most of the times you would come here, it would just be me. That's no nice. How can a fine lady like you always be by herself? You should have a large flock of men crowding around you. Is that how men flock around pretty women? Yes, unless the men are blind to see your beautiful self. <laughs> if you keep telling me how beautiful I am, I think I would accept that I'm beautiful. Are you trying to tell me you've not accepted your beauty? I have, but I don't hear it every time. Are you trying to tell me your man doesn't compliment on the regular? Pick it up and put it on speaker. I want to hear her voice. Hello, Annabelle. Selena, would you be free tomorrow? I would like for us to meet in the hospital. In the hospital? What are we going to do there, Annabelle? We are going to have a DNA test, and I'm sure you will have a problem with that. Really? You don't believe me then, I guess. Is this your idea or Daniel's idea? This is my idea. I want to be sure that Angel is his daughter as you claim. Would you be free tomorrow? I am not sure I want to go for a DNA test. What if Daniel pays someone to manipulate the results? I know he can do something like that. You don't need to worry about that. I'm going to be there with you. And I wouldn't even know the hospital will be using for the test. Okay, tomorrow then. Selena, you heard what she said, right? What are you going to do? Everything will work out. I knew you would ask for a DNA test already. Don't worry about it. Just make sure to send me the address once she sends it to you. What are you going to do? Nothing. You need to worry about. Imagine how shocked you would be when he finds out she's his daughter. <laughs> Ken, you're really funny. I actually think you're fun to be with. No, you're the one who's fun to be with. I can't remember the last time I laughed this hard, Kate. I think you should be a comedian. What do you think? No, that should be you. Tell me, do you make your woman laugh this hard? No, I don't. And that's because I don't have a woman in my life. You're joking, right? There's no way I would believe that. You are lying. Why do you say that? Don't I look single to you? You don't. But tell me, why do you men love to hide your woman from others? I'm not that type of guy. If I have someone in my life, I'll flaunt her around for everyone to see. Most especially if she's as beautiful as you. So if she's less beautiful, you wouldn't flaunt her for all to see? No, that's not what I'm saying. That's what it sounds like to me. So what happened with the last lady you dated? Did you make her laugh so hard that she went away or were you always flirting? <laughs> Are you calling me a flirt, Kate? I like to think of myself as free-spirited. Free-spirited? Maybe that's why she left you. Well, I have to get going now. I've spent more time than I intended. I hope to see you some other time. Take care, Caitlin. See you soon. Shit. Elena left already. How long did we talk? Shit, almost two hours gone. I feel like you're overreacting on everything, Annabelle. I told you to talk things out. I couldn't do that. I keep telling you something isn't right. But I'll come to the root of the matter by tomorrow. The DNA test. Whose idea was it again? Yours or Danny? It was his idea. He seemed pretty confident that she's not his daughter, and Regina also seems confident that the daughter belongs to him. I guess the test will bring all this to an end. Yeah, but what if she's not his daughter? What happens next? Are you asking me? You are the one who thinks that she's his daughter, after he told you that she's not. Do you think I did the right thing? I think you want to clear your doubts. That's it. But you've got to be ready. Ready for what? To accept her if she turns out to be his daughter. 
No, that's a whole different ball game. I'm not sure I'm going to do that. You better begin to consider that. But I don't think she's Danny's daughter. Seeing the way he's being pretty confident on all of this. Selena told me he's confident because he plans to manipulate the results. This is all getting interesting. You know what I think? How about if you do the test results in two different hospitals? You do one in everyone present and ask the doctor to just get enough samples for you because you want to run another. I think I'll do just that. Sounds like a great idea. But what if she's his daughter? What are you going to do? Baby, I'm so sorry. I lost track of time. It's fine with me. It's not fine with you. I just got carried away by our conversations. Yeah, I noticed that. You didn't even look at my side for a second. I wanted to, but I was scared that she would notice me. Scared that she would notice you? You couldn't even steal a single glance at me. You were all focused on her, watching her every move. That's not true, babe. I know what I saw, Ken. You like her already, don't you? Hell no, I don't. Elena, don't take these conversations this way. Please don't. <laughs> oh, I'm right, Ken. You like her already in just few days. You're already having feelings for her, I know. I don't have any feelings for her. I'm not lying. I'm just acting in all of this. I'm acting, baby, I swear. You are a good actor, I must tell you. Because you both had a good time together. I didn't have a good time with her. Do you know what I actually think? I think we should cancel all our plans for the month so you can have enough time to spend with her. No, baby. You know what? I'm not going to do it again. The test and everything. No more. I think you should actually do it. At least you're testing yourself in the process. Shit, Amos. You don't feel it anymore. Though I keep begging you for more. You don't feel it anymore. Anymore. Trying to keep the spark up.